Good morning guys, how are you guys doing? I hope you're all doing well. On today's video, I have my boxy charm unboxing. I haven't shown I haven't been showing you my boxy charm, but this month I said maybe I should. Um yeah, so I picked inside. I received this last Friday. Today's Monday when I'm filming this. And there's something for your eyes. So that's why I have my makeup on except for I haven't set my eyebrows. I haven't done my eyeshadow. I just had my lip gloss. It's the lip maximizer it's this one from dior yeah so let's open the box first thing that i see is lash and brow duo and it says it's um black lash is the brand so this is a duo with a lashed and a brow okay so we're gonna do i haven't opened this Oops. I'm very trying to do light handed. Very sticky. I can feel it. So that's how it looks like with and without. That's not bad. Yeah. So that's the brow product $29 guys so there is a mascara on the other side we'll use that later on I'm scared because I stick to my mascara because I don't like transfer but we'll try the mascara later on so let's go and move on to the next one that I see is um from Jelly's Beauty and it is a double sided wing stamp eyeliner Ooh. I don't know if I want to use this today because I don't... Oh, look at the pretty um, packaging. There's a pointy uh, eyeliner. And then I think it's double-sided. And then there's your stamp. Let's uh, stamp it on my hand and see how it looks like. Oh, so that's for your wing. I don't do eyeliner like that. But let me try the other one. It's so black. I don't use black eyeliner. There you go. That's how. So we'll try it on later on. But let me. I want to put my eyeshadow for Eyeliner. So that eyeliner is $22, guys. Oh, pretty pricey. Next one that I see is from Ace Beauty. Uh, falling for you well this is a fall box I guess for October oh look at the packaging is so beautiful oh wow and the color it has a mirror and look at the color guys this we're gonna play with this and I'm using my brush from I think I got this from boxy charm as well here it's called squash and put it in light pink uh, shimmer I'm scared because it looks chunky and it's called apple just gonna try it on it looks glittery hopefully there's no fallout <music> And then I'm going to go in with, I think I'm going to go in with Autumn. It's called Autumn here in the corner. Just to deepen out my outer V very lightly. Ooh, it's very pigmented. Barely dip and it's very pigmented. Okay, I'm gonna change my brush to a clean one and just blend it away.
think we're pretty good at that. I just took my concealer brush and I'm just gonna clean the corner of my eyes. Eyelid here. And I think I'm happy about that. Yeah, so I'm happy about that. So just to recap what I've used is this one for the first, the first one I used the squash and then the glitter one is called apple. And then to deepen out my outer V, I use autumn. And this is how my eyes looks like. It's pretty good. I didn't make a mess. There's no fallout, but I was really, really careful. It's very pigmented, guys. Um, it looks nothing on the camera, but it is a little bit intense for me. Yes. So what I'm going to do is actually I'm going to get my highlighter that I'm using at the moment. And I'm just going to put a little bit in the corner of my eye. So I'm using the Charlotte Tilbury one. I'm just going to put this highlighter in the corner um, here. Just to lighten that up. So I see fallout everywhere. But not as bad. Now we're gonna try the eyeliner. This one. I'm gonna try the ballpoint first. Let's pray to God because this is hard. I'm just hoping that it doesn't bleed. That's coming in pretty good. Let's do the other side. I just did quarter of my eye, three quarters of my eyes. This is my problem eyes. Not bad. All right, that scares me a little bit, but I think I'm gonna clean out with the Q-tips because the, the corner is not really clean. It's a bit messy. So e.l.f. Uh, sells those pen that corrects eyeliner or correct your makeup, but I don't have it with me. So I'm just using a Q-tips and a micellar water to clean out. Then I'm gonna go over my foundation brush in this corner just like that this is my um, concealer brush and I don't think I'm gonna use the stamp because I'm going to work and I don't really use uh, I don't do a triangle like that and I don't want to like this I don't want to do that because I don't want to mess up and have to wash my face again yeah so that's pretty good hopefully it doesn't bleed I will uh, write down the review uh, how it wears at the end of the day in the description down below yeah so that's how it looks like all right now we're gonna do my mascara gonna uh, use my primer first before we go through this mascara 
I wonder what else is in the box. I really didn't fully open. It's very tiny. So I finished my um, makeup off camera um, and this is how it looks like. Simple, the way I like it because I'm going to work. I haven't done my roots touch up but I will do that off camera. But I just want to get you a recap. Um, there's two more items in the box that I have here. Um, one is actually get to pick this. It's the Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow with niacinamide. So with BoxyCharm, I really haven't looked into it uh, more um uh, in detail but it lets me pick one item you get an email and it says it's ready to customize but i only get to pick one item and most of the time the one that i want is already uh, sold out but this one i'm really looking forward to uh trying to use this i have a lot of skincare right now that i've been getting from a subscription box but looking forward to this and i'm loving you guys the one that i got from boxy charm Oh no, this is not Bakuji Jam. The one that I got from um Fab Fit Fun. This um Rodeal Pink Diamond. I'm loving this guys. I use this every morning before I put my makeup on as a serum and it works really wonder in my skin. I look my skin looks flawless when I use it. I can tell when I'm not using it, so that's what I'm loving. And I'm hoping that this one would actually be the same because I think this is a glow serum as well. Another one that I'm disappointed is a makeup remover. You guys, this is my second week, at uh, second month that I got a makeup remover. I got one last time too. I don't use makeup remover and I don't want to start using it. So I use it for swatch for now, but yeah. And it says here, for refining witch hazel. And this one is... um. $20 guys so that's everything that's in my box at this moment and I'm glad that I can film this uh, and try it out with you guys I will update the description down below when I upload this and how the mascara and the eyeliner held up so guys to give you a recap of what I've used on my face from the boxy charm I started with uh, this tint lash and brow duo so on my eyebrows, I have my Anastasia Beverly Hills brow pencil. And then I use this um, brow gel to um, set it. It's very tacky. It's like sticky. And it keeps your hair a little bit crunchy. And it gives it adds um, color, but it doesn't have fiber. I don't mind it. I don't love it. But we'll see how it holds up. So that's the brow um that's the brow product and then on the other side is my lash. So this is how it looks like. I don't want to go crazy. I just put probably um two coats, actually one and a half coat. I don't go crazy with my eyeshadow, my eyelashes. I don't go crazy with my eyelashes because I wear glasses and it if I put too much it touches my glasses which bothers me. So that one again I will um leave uh, a comment on the description down below see how it held up and then i use the eyeliner which is very cute it's called jelly's beauty it's pink and i didn't use i used the, the fine point but i didn't use the stamp point maybe one day we will play around with it but that's what i used on my eyeliner which i don't really use eyeliner a lot and then the the star of the show is the Ace Beauty. I don't mind the eyeshadow. It looks really... But I have this color in my collection already. Maybe next time I will try the Cherry Pie. So this is the color um, cutaway for this uh, makeup. Um, so I use this, this, and that corner. Yeah. And that's how it looks like on my eyes. Not too bad. I see some um, glitters underneath my eyes. But I just... Um, powder it away and it looks fine i don't see anymore yeah so there's a fallout nothing special day 
so that's it guys that's it for this video i hope you guys enjoy this video and let me just take care of my roots and i'll see you guys on my next one bye